Hey guys, I'm going to show you how to kill the great colored carp. And of course, we're going to get the great colored carp trophy in the process. And I'm going to start off at the Fountainhead Palace. We're at the palace grounds. In order to get here, you're going to have to swim through an underground cave, get chased by the carp. You're going to eventually get up here. And this is part of the story path, so don't worry. This isn't off the beaten path. Anyways, there's the cave that we made our way through. We had to swim through it. We're going to grapple our way back up to the location that I'm at now. And there's a house. Make sure you open the door just to your left there. It just gives you a shortcut path. And we're going to make our way back out to the back of the house here. And we are going to turn around. And we're able to grapple up onto the roof. So we're going to do that. And head back to the main area where the lake is. And uh, you can see this little area over here. What we need to do is grapple onto this branch. And make our way here to the left to these new set of buildings. And we're gonna be very careful of this archer up here. He's quite a nuisance. And we're gonna drop down. Now there is an idol here. You wanna make sure you activate that. We will be coming back here a couple times. Now what we're gonna do down here is feed the carp. First, we're gonna start a side quest from this gentleman right here. Apparently his only goal in life is to feed the carp. Well, we're going to try to feed the carp. We're going to do that by ringing the bell. Now the carp's going to come up here, and you're going to have the option to feed them, provided you have some precious bait. You can find precious bait. I found a lot underwater. Anyways, we're going to leave now. We need to find some poisonous bait, some truly special bait, in order to kill the carp. So in order to do that, we need to go find one of the, the scale merchants. Now, there's a few of them, a couple of them. Uh, there might be more than two, but there's one in Harada Estate at the Estate Path Idol. There's actually one close by there, but what we need to do is spend seven scales at one of these merchants. Again, the scale merchants. These merchants are the ones that are in the barrels. Very weird, strange, but we're going to jump down here, start swimming off to this little island where we will find the big barrel with the merchant inside of it. Now, again, you need to spend seven scales in order to get the truly precious bait. Now, this vendor just happens to sell an item that's exactly seven scales, which is why I chose this vendor here. So we're going to purchase some items with scales. And there's a mass fragment there. Mass fragment, right? Seven scales. We're going to purchase that. By the way, if you get all three fragments of the mask, you can then spend five skill points to upgrade your attack. So just a little FYI, a little side note there. There are three pieces. There's one there. We are going to leave and then talk. So you're going to back out of the menu and then talk to them. And then you're going to talk to them again. The talk option does not come up unless you've spent at least seven scales. Talk to them twice and you will be given the truly precious bait. This is the bait that's going to kill the carp. So from there, go back to the idol, fast travel back to the feeding grounds, go ring the bell. And we are going to now have two options. You have an option to use the precious bait, which I've already done once. And then you also have an option to select truly precious bait. Now, for some reason, I just throw the regular precious bait out there. I don't know why. So let's try it again. Select the precious bait. And this is going to be poisonous. Now, somehow, this fish, this carp, is going to come, go from Fountainhead all the way to Sunken Valley before he dies. Why or how? I have no idea. So let's go over to the Sunken Valley. We're going to go to the Guardian's Ape Watering Hole. This place gives me nightmares. So now you see the fish, the carp, is right there. And right in front of him is going to be an object. We're going to pick this up. This is the Great White Whisker. Picking that up will earn you the trophy. But... The quest isn't done yet. If you're just looking for the trophy, great. Otherwise, you can go back to the feeding grounds, and then you can talk to the quest giver one more time, and uh, he'll basically be done with his duties. He won't have to feed the great carp anymore. And in return, we are going to get an item from him. He's going to be mourning this poor fish for a long time, but his duties are complete. There it is, Divine Grass. So it restores vitality and cures all status abnormalities. That's it. That's how you get the trophy. That's how you complete this quest and kill the great colored carp. Thanks for watching, guys. Please subscribe. We'll see you soon.